Hi. <laughs> Hi, honey. Oh, I missed you too. Hush, I missed you most. Mm-mm. No, there's just no way that you can miss me more than I missed you. Babe, you're amazing, but I missed you more. (laughs) Hush. Hmm. I really miss moments like these. I don't know, just these peaceful moments. Just laying together in bed, you know, just talking. Even though it's me talking and you trying not to fall asleep, which I'm sorry about, but it's really cute. It's really sweet. And plus, you just look so adorable. And your eyes get all droopy. I can start, you know, hearing you breathe a little bit harder. I don't know, it's really relaxing. (laughs) I'm glad you feel that way. (laughs) It's nice to know that you feel just as relaxed as me. Because I really do feel safe when I'm with you. Mm -hmm. I really do. You're really sweet. I think I need to get off um, TikTok, you know? Like, I just see so many posts about um, like how awful people's boyfriends are and things like that. It's, it's kind of insane, you know? And I start thinking about you, like, Oh my gosh, is he like cheating on me or something crazy? And I don't know, you're really sweet. And a lot of times when, you know, I'll tell you that I don't like something or what you said upset me, you're usually really good about not being mean or super defensive. I'm not toxic. Am I? Okay. Good. I don't want to be toxic. Because I really love you. And I really care for you. I want to bring, you know, joy and happiness and a little bit of peace to your life, you know, not negativity and all that terrible stuff. <laughs> Good. Yeah, I should probably stay off TikTok for a while. <sighs> no, it's crazy. You know, you just, you just see, I think, the worst in people, and you see, like, the extremes, you know, because people can hide and they don't have to show their face, but I don't know, just seeing how the comments and girls talking about how they've been dating a guy for like, I don't know, a long time and he does something awful, I get, you know, a little bit nervous, because you're like, I thought he was perfect. And then he did this. And I really do think you're amazing. And kind. And it's like I can't imagine you doing those awful things. But then I get like scared. And uh, it's such an awful feeling. You know, thinking 
yeah, I know. I need to stop imagining that. Like, I start to hurt my own feelings, you know? <laughs> really dumb, but... I love you. I really love you. And I think it's like... <laughs> this is gonna sound awful, but... I don't mean it in a terribly negative way, but I don't think I've ever cried as much, like, since I've been with you. <laughs> like, <laughs> don't take it in such an awful way. Just, like, I think before I met you, I didn't cry too much. I was, like, uh... I don't know, maybe I cried, like, twice a month, which isn't too crazy, you know, especially being a girl, but, like, I don't know, and then when I started dating you, just, I think it's because I care so much about you and how I think you view me and things like that, um, I don't know, I used to get really, I used to hurt my own feelings thinking that I was being really annoying and you didn't want to, like, hang out with me or something, even though it's, like, like, you're busy and, like, you know, with work and school and, like, I know that in my head, um, I don't know, I just, it just, like, the brain plays tricks on you, so it's, like, oh, he's, like, he's at work. Like, he's busy. <laughs> but I'm like, oh, maybe he hates me. Or maybe I'm being really annoying. But yeah, I, I've gotten... <laughs> yeah, I think I've gotten better too. But sometimes it's nice, you know, when you, like, affirm me that you still love me. <laughs> I love you too. And that, like, I'm not annoying you. Because sometimes, I, I don't know, sometimes I can talk a lot. <laughs> Which, I know, like, I'm, I'm an introvert and I'm on the shy side. But it's like, I'm only shy towards people who I don't really know, you know? But, like, once I know somebody and, like, like, we're best friends or we're dating, or in our case, we're, like, best friends and dating. <laughs> I just feel so comfortable with you, you know, and I don't know. And then sometimes I get in my head that, like, I'll talk too fast and I'll stumble over my words and it'll be, like, you can't comprehend what I'm saying because it's just a big mumble jumble of randomness and you know that kind of I kind of hurt my own feelings like like oh man like I probably sound so dumb and stupid like he thinks I'm like crazy or something mm, thank you honey <laughs> My sweet boy. Mm. <laughs> I really love you. I love you most. <laughs> but yeah, that's just me getting in my head and overthinking. Yeah, I know, honey. And you're doing a really good job. You know that? I mean, you're like... Uh, my... I want to say my first, like, official boyfriend, you know? Well, technically, I dated a guy before you, but it was, like, when 
I was in high school. It was, it was very short. Yeah, like not even a week long. But I don't know, it was different. Like when I dated, like started dating you, it was like I was scared at first, you know, and almost scared of commitment, which sounds bad. Like uh, I'm not a cheater and I, I promise, honey, I'll never cheat on you. Like it's really easy not to cheat, but I think I was scared of like, I think putting myself out there, you know, and you just feel really exposed when you're dating someone, you know, cause like, like you have my heart. It's like a scary thing, but I mean, you've proven to be a really great guy and you've taken care of it um, pretty well. And you're really sweet, so, you know, now it's like, oh, like why was I ever scared? But yeah, just again, babe, just. I think sometimes if I'm feeling down or, like, insecure or something, just some words of affirmation would be really helpful. <laughs> I mean, like, I, for guys, it can be different sometimes. But us girls, it's like, I don't know. I think we think a lot. We overthink. And we think like, oh, maybe he's doing this because he's upset, you know? Because like a lot of girls, I'm like, I'm guilty of this, but we'll give, we'll like, we'll drop hints. You know, like if we're upset, we'll be kind of passive and blah, blah, blah and all this stuff. And, you know, but I think I'm, I'm getting better at just being a little more honest with my feelings, but it is hard. <laughs> You know, like, we drop hints, you know, like, when we're upset, you know, and I feel like a lot of times guys have troubles picking up on it because guys are a little more open and honest, like, with their feelings, especially it's like, oh, I don't like that you're doing this or anything like that, you know, but I don't know, it's weird because, like, you'll be doing something and in my head, I think that you're trying to drop a hint, you know, even though it's just you being, you were like a normal thing. So I'm like, oh, like, he's upset. When in reality, you know, you're just going about your day. <laughs> Isn't that kind of funny? <laughs> I shouldn't worry. But yeah, you're really great. You know that. Mm -hmm. You're really amazing. And you're really sweet. And you're super duper lovable. And I just want to squish your cheeks. flexible tomorrow so we can talk more about your schedule and you know what what we can do it is getting a little bit colder so maybe not an outside activity <laughs> I know I want to it's just I just don't like the cold <laughs> I just don't do too well. But yeah, we can do that. And then we can go, 
you can either go out to eat or make something together which I think that could be kind of fun and then we can go to Bible study together and I'm thinking after we can watch a movie or play games <laughs> I know you said that you have that new um like fighting game or something yeah we could <laughs> i mean you'll play it and i will button smash <laughs> mm. but do you remember that one time we were playing that fighting game oh, it was not one of your friend's house but it was we were competing against each other and i felt bad but i was just button smashing there's a lot of buttons, okay? I didn't know what they all did. And remember how I beat you? Right, I mean, it was only one game. But I beat you. And do you remember what you said? <laughs> Come on, babe. Look at me. Look at you getting all red. Oh, you said something along the lines of like, oh, like, I don't even like this game. It's okay. No, I'm not making fun of you. You're too cute. I thought that was really funny, though. <laughs> so don't don't go too hard and try to like beat me when we play games together, like out of revenge. <laughs> you promise? God, because that's gonna hurt my feelings. <laughs> okay <laughs> but yeah i'll tr I'll try to give you a good fight. I probably won't though <laughs> yeah, you just wait and then I'm gonna be a super gaming pro. <laughs> had a long day. <laughs> you do look a little bit sleepy. You look so cute, you know. Close your eyes, okay? Good, good boy. Just start to relax, okay? Good, and I love you. <laughs> Good night.